Some first-time investors think that it is wiser to save up their money first to buy below market value deals later on. But I'll show you how investing now in pre-selling properties can give you bigger gains with a smaller cash outlay. I'm Edric Maguan, and this is The Real Deal. Welcome to my channel. I'll be sharing with you real stories and practical investment strategies so you can have the confidence to start and grow your real estate investments today. There's this famous saying that goes, don't wait to buy real estate, buy real estate and wait. I can truly attest to this. When I started exploring real estate investing, I thought about looking into good deals in the resale market because of the prospect of huge savings. I found out that resale deals require a huge sum of cash up front, usually 30% or more of the total price. At that time, I didn't have a lot of money saved up, so it would take me a few years before I could make up for the cash payment. But at the same time, I knew that property prices would go up. So if I wait even for a few years, double whammy na. First, mas mahal na ang property prices later on. Mahama price out naho in the future. Second, sighing in capital appreciation that I could have earned and maximized by investing earlier. So I took the active step and invested in pre selling properties where I've been able to maximize my capital gains with minimal cash outlay. Instead of mag save mo naho, I would slowly pay the down payment of a pre selling property. And at the same time, I would already be enjoying the capital appreciation from the moment I reserve my unit. Let's take the following example to see how this works. Person A is planning ahead and has invested in a two-bedroom unit in a newly launched pre-selling property, Property X. The developer offers terms with no spot cash down payment and a monthly down payment of 31,250 pesos over the next 48 months. The total contract price is 7.5 million. After four years, his unit has grown in value by 10% compounded annual growth rate and now has a market value of 11 million, an increase of 3.5 million versus his purchase price. To date, the total cash paid by person A is 1.5 million, giving him a return on investment or ROI of 233%. On the other hand, person B, who has just been saving up for the past four years, decides that he has to invest in a property already and found a great deal in Property X for a two-bedroom condo unit. It's selling for 9 million, lower than its market value of 11 million. This gives him savings of 2 million. For this unit, he paid the seller 3 million in cash and got a home loan for the balance. This gives him an ROI of 67%. By planning ahead, not only does person A enjoy a bigger net gain compared to person B, he also just spent half the amount of cash. With this, Person A has an ROI that is more than triple of Person B. A little planning definitely goes a long way, as you can maximize your gains while minimizing your cash outlay, thereby increasing your return on investment, which is a key measure of investment success. If you need help in getting the right property investment for you, send me a message or sign up for a free consultation with me via the link in the description. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you guys next time.